motorbike that one. The thing is later they post motorbike. Oh. Singapore not allowed one. Then how? It's okay lah. Can I? Yeah. Because here allowed right? It's okay. Yeah. Government here allowed. Even though they take the road. Yeah. Then how about today go to the beach? Mm. safety, especially for the motorcyclists. Uh, other than that, I think uh, everything is really nice here. Yeah? Nice fresh air, trees, nature, back to nature. Um, what are you going to say? I think for myself, since I've been living overseas as well to study, I think this was a really good break. And like he said, we haven't been here in about 12 years. So coming back, it was good to see Auntie Su because she used to work with us for such a long time. And I finally started to try to learn how to ride a bike. So I was doing it in front and I think it was really, really good and interesting. And I really like the lifestyle here as well. It's slow and everyone's really, really friendly. Like everyone, when you walk on the streets, everyone just says hi. I think that's something really nice I enjoy. We also visited the beaches this morning and something I noticed was that all the beaches had black sand. And you wouldn't see that at all in Singapore. So I think that's good, yeah. Mm-hmm. What about the food? How oh, we had lunch? Um, lunch, soup. <coughs> yeah, we had uh, ikan bakar. Mm. I tried ikan bakar for the first time and I actually really enjoyed mm. it. And yesterday, Auntie Sue made like fresh water, uh, fresh water catfish and I've never had fresh water fish before. So that was... <laughs> That's interesting and it's good. I miss home cooked food because I'm so used to cook for us like food all the time. Like the bitter god and dimpe. So that's something I made her cook for me when I arrived. Yeah. And then, and don't forget the sambal eggs also. Yeah, like the sambal also. Yeah. So like really, really spicy food. <laughs> so um, one more thing we'd like to thank Adisu and her family for having us here. The last time we were here, the whole family was here, my wife and two other boys, a brother. Yuki is in the center, so we got one more elder brother and another younger brother. Unfortunately, they can't come on this trip. So hopefully, uh, we'll come in the near future again, to yeah. the whole family again. I hope, I hope that. Ten, ten yeah. more years. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, I'm done. I'm not so long. After I old oh, lady, I'll just stick at it. Yeah, no, yes, the next trip won't be, uh, won't be 12 years from now. Uh, maybe it will yeah, be shorter. One year. <laughs> two, two, three years after I graduate, then maybe okay, you'll come okay. back again. Yeah, mm. yeah she got yeah, two more years to graduate yes. from her uni. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I was everything. Oh, welcome to my home. Oh, so. My home. Not too much. 
Yeah. Next yeah. time we have more yeah. grandchildren. Do prop me yet? <laughs> oh, yeah, today also we yeah, went. Sober, also <laughs> yeah, today we also <laughs> took the bike and we went to an elder son's place. Uh, Sulis, Sulis house. Sulis. Mm. Where was that? I don't know. Santolo. Santolo place. Santolo. Yeah, Santolo. Santolo. Yeah, Santolo. Yeah. 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 Half an hour yeah. by motorbike. Oh, good. So tomorrow. Sometimes so scary. One to oh. ten, one to ten hours. The... <laughs> the sun is like motor. Traffic is really very, very, very difficult. Yeah. Very difficult. Yeah. 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 I thought must turn back. Can't see how. But the good thing that I too have been riding.